Here we're going to cover instructions for using the graphing calculator to create your lists um, for the trapezoidal rule. Uh, we're going to be using the same example, f of x equals 2 over the square root of x, uh, evaluated for the interval from 2 to 4 with four subintervals, and we already calculated previously that the height of each interval therefore would be a half. We got that by doing five, 4 minus 2 divided by 4. Um, so we can create these lists on our calculator um, by going to the lists. We get there by hitting the stat button and edit, hit enter for edit. You should have your lists here. If your lists are populated, you'll want to clear them by arrowing up to the column header and hitting clear and enter, and that should clear out the column. So do that for any columns that already have values. The first column is going to represent our i, our intervals, and we start with zero every time and just enter integers from zero to n. So since n is four, we're gonna go from zero to four. One, two, three, four. For the second list, instead of entering the list manually, we're going to go to the list header, so highlight L2. Here we're going to enter our specific A value plus our specific H value times L1 so that we don't have to enter each of them ourselves. What this list L2 represents is the X value for each that borders each interval. And so um, we're gonna, our starting x value is 2 plus the height of each interval or the width of each inter interval we set as a half, 4.5 times whatever the value, the corresponding value from list 1 is. So we're going to do second L1, which we do second the button 1. That's going to take whatever the value is from L1, multiply it by a half, and add it to two. When you hit enter, that should give you this list of values, which is the same that you calculated by hand by just starting A at A and adding a half to each uh, previous X value. Now we can do this something similar for list three. List three is the function evaluated at each of those X values listed in list two. Um, or f of x i. Here we just need to type in the function um, that we're evaluating. In this case, it's 2 over the square root of x. But in the place of x, we're going to use list 2 as our x values. So highlight L3, type in 2 divided by the square root of, instead of the square root of x again, we're doing second L2. And when you hit enter, that populates the list three uh, entries with the function evaluated at each of those x values, which is the same thing you should have had gotten when you calculated this by hand. So now you have the list, and you can use the list to evaluate the trapezoid rule.